Oh, hey there. Welcome home. Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy, I, uh, I'm not here to harm you. I'm not a burglar or anything like that. I'm Jesse. Oh, uh, almost forgot. Here. That's my paperwork. Um, I hope that clears up any confusion. Yup, I am a full-fledged Naga. <laughs> Pretty sweet, right? I'm super strong and got this lovely tail, and I give the best cuddles, and... Hmm... What else do humans like about us? <laughs> I'm just trying to give a good first impression here. Uh, as you can tell by my paperwork, you have been chosen as a monster caretaker. And I know that sounds like a big deal, but in reality, you don't really have to take care of me too much. It's more of a formality. The government is trying to make sure that monsters like myself are better accepted into society. So, they're selecting certain humans who, based on their research, they think are kind and caring and would be accepting of someone like me. They hope that having monsters live with humans, it'll make other humans more accepting. It's kind of like... You know how some people really do not like cats, but then their best friend gets a cat, and all of a sudden, every time they come over, the cat's trying to snuggle up to them as being all cute and stuff. Usually after a week or two, the cat hater becomes a cat lover and is constantly petting them. <laughs> it's the same idea. If you don't like monsters, but all of a sudden your best friend has a monster roommate, the hope is that over time people will warm up to us and be more understanding. Will it actually work? I guess only time will tell. But, uh... You don't hate monsters, do you? Thank goodness. Because if you did, that would make living with you really, really awkward. Oh, there's also a number at the bottom of my paperwork if you want to call the agency for more details and stuff. But since we're going to be living together and you're going to help me get integrated into human society and all that, you're going to get paid. Every single week, they'll send a check in the mail and, uh, I mean, it's kind of a lot. <laughs> they hope that monster caretakers will quit their jobs to devote their full attention to us. <laughs> so they provide a steady income to help encourage that. Um, I'm sorry, this is a lot to process, isn't it? Uh, you look kind of out of it. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. In summary, you're in charge of taking care of me, and the government is going to pay you a lot of money to do that. And unless you call them and decline the proposition, you'll make enough money to never have to work another day in your life. <laughs> How do I feel about all this? Uh, the honest answer? I know I seem all bright and confident and stuff, but deep down, I'm kind of terrified. I mean, I know this is all so sudden for you, you know, me showing up to your house and all, but it's also super sudden for me. I mean, all my life I've been in and out of government facilities because no civilians wanted to care for me. And now I'm just 
thrown into living with a stranger who I've never met before. I mean, no offense when I say that, but, you know, you are a stranger. Um, but you actually seem like a really cool person from the brief interaction we've had here today. Uh, but, yeah, I think it's going to take some time to get used to. I just hope... I don't know. I just hope we can be real friends. Not this artificial, you're keeping me around because you're getting money for caring for me. I hope we can actually warm up to each other. <laughs> Tell you something about me. Um, sure. Well, my name is Jesse. I'm 19 years old. Um, I like Disney movies. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm actually quite boring now that I'm trying to think of what to talk about with myself. My favorite Disney movie? Well, in the facility there wasn't much to choose from. We kind of just had a stack of old VHSs and <laughs> watched those on repeat again and again. But I was always a big fan of Beauty and the Beast. It's so cute and colorful and... Well, there's a lot to like about it, so I won't ramble your ear off with that right now. Huh? What do you mean we can watch all of the Disney movies online? Seriously? For free? Um... I don't know if you have plans tonight, but can we do that? Like, right now? <laughs> okay, sounds good. You'll get the popcorn. What the heck is popcorn? Popcorn.